hope you are doing good and enjoying your holidays but studies are necessary you know so i am shraddha shukla i am going to introduce the first chapter of your subject science and that is teeth and microbes today's topics are teeth and their importance the second topic is parts of a tooth and the third topic is layer of a tooth and the further things we'll discuss in the next class okay so i am going to start with the first topic that is teeth and their importance okay you must have seen so many times that the younger children and the elderly people they have to survive on the liquid diets such as milk uh, pulses and porridge but why is it so have you ever thought about it why is it so it is because they don't have teeth they can't bite anything they can't tear it they can't chew it and also they cannot grind it so basically teeth help us in biting cutting chewing and grinding our food okay now the first set of teeth grown in a child is known as the temporary teeth or the milk teeth they are 20 in numbers 10 in the upper jaw and 10 in the lower jaw these are the jaws as you can see in your mouth there are two jaws the upper jaw and the lower jaw they are 20 in numbers 10 in the upper jaw and 10 in the lower jaw why do we call it temporary teeth we call them temporary teeth because they stay with us for a shorter time for few years and are after some times when a child grows they are replaced by much stronger and harder teeth that is permanent teeth okay now the permanent teeth are 32 in numbers and why do we call it permanent teeth because they survive with us for a lifetime okay now let's discuss the parts now we are going to discuss the second topic the parts of a tooth there are three parts of a tooth the uppermost part the middle part and the lowest part the uppermost part that is visible to us very easily that is crown you can see it easily in the mirror okay now now we are going to talk about the lower most part this one you must have seen that the trees are deeply rooted in the soil and that is why they can survive even in the storms similarly our teeth are embedded in our gums with the help of roots this part of teeth is called root and the middle part is known as neck okay this part is known as neck fine okay now i am going to tell you the third topic and that is layers of a tooth okay first i need to draw it okay as you can see it in the diagram i have done i have drawn three different layers this this one and the last one okay so first of all i'm going to tell you the about the first layer and that is the strongest and hardest layer that is known as enamel okay this part of this layer is known as enamel okay it is the strongest layer and it protects the innermost layers of the teeth okay now i am going to discuss about the second layer it is a little softer than the enamel but stronger than the lower most layer okay it is known as dentine this layer is known as dentine now i am going to discuss about the third layer that is known as pulp for this i am going to ask you a question have you ever seen anyone eating something so cold or so hot uh, after that they have some sensations in their mouth some pain in their mouth okay that is known as sensitivity it is because the pulp contains some nerves and some veins because of that the sensations occurs okay so there are three different parts of the teeth and three different layers of a teeth you can easily draw it this one is the pulp this is dentine 
and this is enamel the whole layer is enamel okay so i am going to give you a task the task for my today's class is number 1 draw the different parts of tooth and second draw the different layers of a tooth okay so students now we are going to discuss about the types of teeth there are different type of teeth according to the work they do what are the works the biting of food the cutting of food the chewing or the grinding of food okay so according to this there are four types of teeth first one is incisors second one is canines then premolars and then molars okay so i am going to start the first topic and that is incisors incisors are the front four teeth in the in both of the jaws okay in the upper jaws and in the lower jaws you can easily see them in the mirror the front four teeth in the upper jaw and in the lower jaw they are eight in numbers four in the upper jaw four in the lower jaw okay now they are flat and sharp edged you need to remember this they are flat and sharp edged okay they help us to bite our food they work they do this work okay they help us to bite our food now i am going to tell you about canines one canine is present on both sides of the incisors two in the upper jaw and two in the lower jaw that means four in total you can easily see them they are very sharp and pointed they are here at the corner uh, you must have seen dogs they have very sharp pointed teeth uh, on four of the corners of their jaws so they are these are canines okay now they they are very sharp pointed and they are right present right beside of the incisors okay so they are sharp and pointed they help us to tear our food mostly the animals have the canines and they tear their flesh uh, tear their flesh accord uh, using their canines okay so these are used to tear the flesh or the food okay now let's move to premolars premolars are present next to the canines okay they are broad flat and help us to chew our food and break them in fine parts okay they are eight in numbers four in each jaws two on each side of the jaw okay now they are flat broad they help us to break our food in fine particles okay now let's move to molars molars do the similar work as premolars do but they also grind the food properly they they help us to digest our food and they grind the food in a very fine fine particles okay so they are 12 in numbers that means six in each jaws three on each side of the jaw okay they are also flat and broad flat and broad they grind the food okay now this is very difficult to learn the names and the numbers so i am giving uh, you uh, an easy idea to learn them the formula is i c p m 8 4 8 12 incisors are 8 canines are 
प्री मोलर्स आर एट एन नंबर एंड मोलर्स आर ट्वेल्व एन नंबर सो द फॉर्मूला इज आई सी पी एम एट फोर एट ट्वेल्व ओके थैंक यू